You might be in a situation right now that you want to know, did God send this person or did a devil send this person? Listen, my friend, and listen to me very carefully. God don't send somebody to make you fall. God does not send somebody go to God that does not love God. God send the best. He go to God. God send somebody to encourage you, not to bring you down or to or to make you make you less than a person you are. So if you're wondering, did God send this person to me? You will know. The Bible says you should know them by their fruits. The Bible says know them who labor among you. So if you're wondering, did God send this person my way? How you gonna know? The Bible says try the spirit by the spirit to see whether it be of God because there are many false prophets have entered into the world. My friend, you gotta be a person that know that if God send you this person, God gonna give you confirmation. God gonna give you declaration and God gonna give you signs that that sign that you think is not. My friend, God don't send no devil. What I say, God does not send a wicked, evil, treacherous person your way. So if you're wondering, did God send this person my way? Listen, I'm gonna tell you something. Never accept a person's prophecy. He go to God. And somebody and somebody said, God, God, God told me that you're gonna be my wife. God gonna God gonna tell me if, if are you gonna be my husband? Listen, the only way you're gonna know if God gave you Oh, glory to God, the character. God gave you the quality of the person he sent your way. If God, if, if that person is not, glory to God, depicted in your, in your prophecy or depicted in what you want, my friend, that's not from God. Because God ain't gonna send you somebody that opposite what, Glory to God, a person that you dream about heaven. Because the devil might send, glory to God, he, he might send somebody that almost look like the same person. So you're wondering, did God send me this or it was the devil? My friend, listen, my friend, it's like an apple tree. An apple tree don't be orange. And an orange tree don't be apple. So if you, if somebody come to you and say, God say you gonna be my wife. My friend, make sure it's the wife that you depicted. It's the wife, glory to God. A wife, the Bible says, a man that seek a wife, seek a wife, seek a good thing, and have favor with the Lord. So make sure, glory to God, this woman is not a Jezebel. Make sure this man is not a monster. I'm saying to you, my friend, is this from God? You gotta know, whatever, shut up now, if this person is from God or this person is from the devil. Because the devil don't look like, hallelujah, ugly. The devil don't look like Hollywood with slob coming out of his mouth and a, and a red suit and a pick four. That's not the devil. The devil, my friend, he come in a, in a hallelujah, a money suit. He comes in in a red dress. He comes, glory to God, beautiful or handsome. The devil don't come gooky. The devil don't come like a monster. He come as an angel of light. So you're wondering, is this person from the devil or is this person from God? My friend, if it's from God, you will know it's from God. Hallelujah, because God give qualities, glory to God, that are righteous. Hey, glory to God. God give quality, a person, the spirit gonna agree with your spirit. Glory to God, that they are from God. My friend, don't never get, get off the brakes. Hey man, I put on gas and don't get off the brakes, my friend. You ought to, you ought to break it. Mean break it mean you stop, you observe, you listen, you learn, you love, my friend. But if it's from God, God gonna give you everything that you ask God for. God ain't give you no shortcut. Amen. So we gotta know whether this person is from God or not. The Bible say, my friend, try the spirit, by the spirit, to see whether they be of God, because there are many false prophets have entered into the world and we got to know the qualities what God sent us. Come on now. We, we got a Bible. Do you have a Bible? Hey, glory to God. A person that say they're Christian, they ought to have the nine fruit of the spirit. 
And the ninth fruit of the Spirit is in Galatians. Galatians 5, 22 and 23, my friend. They have the, have the qualities of being a Christian. There's a quality of being a Christian. Everybody's a Christian, but everybody's not a Christian. So if you say this person is from God, they call to God. If this person from God, they wouldn't be cussing. If this person, glory to God, for God, they wouldn't want to have sex and you're not married. If a person is from God, they wouldn't be drinking under pressure. They wouldn't be smoking weed under pressure. Oh, this person, no. If God sent you somebody, God ain't going to send you no devil. In court to God, hallelujah, hallelujah. I'm trying to tell somebody right now. How you know is this person that I'm going to marry is from God? If they're from God, they wouldn't want to have sex with you before you get before you say I do. Come on now, wake up. You gotta know whether or not this person is from God before you marry them. They got a drinking problem. They smell like liquor. God ain't gonna send you no drunk. God ain't gonna send no no weed smoker. God ain't gonna send nobody that's opposite, glory to God, of the qualification of being a being a being a Christian or a man of God. A man of God is a preacher, a man of God is a pastor, a man of God is a person that have qualification of being, hey, glory to God, a man of God. God ain't gonna say no woman devil. Hallelujah. Well, I say God ain't gonna send you no Jezebel. God ain't gonna send you, glory to God, no evil, wicked woman. God, God going to send you Abigail. God going to send you Sarah. Hallelujah. God going to send you a Japora. Hey, glory to God. God going to send you the qualities what the Bible say a woman ought to be. And listen to me very carefully because I want to know that God sent it. If you know God sent it, my friend, it will agree with your spirit. If it don't agree with your spirit, don't accept it. Hallelujah. Say, I got to pray on this. Don't say, I yes. Don't accept that ring. If that ring, glory to God, is not going to bring a glory to God ringing in your ears. If this ring will be miserable, my friend, don't accept the ring. Hallelujah. And don't accept the condom, neither. Hey, glory to God. If you say it's from God, why are you using condom? Come on now. If if you if you if you you say from God, why? Why you want me to tongue kiss you? Why? Come on now. Why? Come on. You say you from God. But you are you opposite of what the Bible say you are. Is this from God? You ought to know, hallelujah. You ought to know the qualification of a Christian or a church goer. If you don't, you need to watch my videos of the qualification of a church goer and the qualification of a Christian. Everybody say they're Christian. My friend, but everybody is not a Christian. So is this person from God? Hey, glory to God. Did God send me this person or did the devil send it to me? Hey, glory to God. Hallelujah. We ought to know them. That labor among us. This person you say is praying, is praying for you. They're praying against you. And it's time for you to stop. They binding you and they're supposed to be breaking, breaking the, the barrier, breaking the spirit. But they are, they are binding you. Is this person from God? Hallelujah. Glory to God. You ought to know. My friend, every time you can't sleep at night, since you met this person, you can't sleep at night. Since you met this person, my friend, glory to God, you've been getting headaches and heartaches and backaches because this person is not from God. It's from the devil. Hallelujah. Glory to God. The devil sent a devil your way. Glory to God. And you're going to say, I do. For what? The Bible says, hey, God, don't judge according to appearance, but judge righteous judgment. If this person from God, you ought to judge of righteous judgment. Hallelujah. Don't, it's not according to appearance. Come on now. The devil ain't going to say you something that you don't want. The devil says something that you want. He got to know. Oh, glory to You got to know this person from the devil. Hey, glory to God. Wake up. Wake up. You sleep. Wake up. This person is not from God, but from the devil. And you got to know them who labor among you. Try the spirit. How you try the spirit? Light them up with the word of God. Amen. Don't forget to subscribe to our video. And thank you for watching Life Journey. Glory to God International. God bless. Peace.